mean, this camera is getting everything. And I mean everything in 4K. Like, I can see. Myself so clearly. What's up? To blend, what's up? To blend, hey, your girl's back, hey, your girl's back, hey, yo, girl is back. Welcome back to the channel, y'all. Welcome back, welcome back to the vlog. Actually, this is a vlog, so make sure that you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Because if you don't subscribe to the channel, if you're not subscribed to this channel, why are you watching it? Just subscribe right now. It's not, it's not about to be a big deal, I promise you. Anyway. So, I'm going to do a mukbang right now. I just cooked some food. But I had to start it vlog style. I'm going to do the mukbang kind of vlog style, I want to say. Because I just don't know what my kid's going to be up to. You know, he's being pretty busy. I'm trying to settle him down. So, I'm thinking he's about to get some puzzles. Look, this new, this new camera is a little heavier. So, I don't plan on shooting all my vlogs from this camera. It's going to still be from the other one. But, I mean, I'm excited about this one, so why not? This is my stationary camera. The camera I work with, or whatever. This is why I'm starting to understand why YouTubers have so many. Like, you just gotta be precious. My room's a mess, kinda. Getting ready for, you know, do this thing and all. I don't know where this, I don't know where this video's going. This is, this, we don't know, we don't know what's going on today. We don't. Okay? I know I'm about to vlog me eating this um noodles and some crab legs yes i'm eating some meat today seafood i'm still eating that yes and i feel the need to say that all the time hmm. so let's get to the uh let me show y'all the food that i got yeah. we're getting a tripod i don't really want to take the tripod because i'm afraid that Cyrus is gonna pay too much attention and then I'm just going to be messing with the camera and for like fussing with him. Because you can't really tell a two-year-old what to do like that. Like you can, but you kind of can't. And this memory card is running out of memory. So I'll see y'all after I set up and I'll let y'all know what I did with Sai. All right. Yeah. All right, y'all. Here go the noodles that I got. Cooked up. Make some spicy noodles. Um... I had these before, they're pretty good. So, they've been done. And I low key been sitting over here, standing over here, eating them out the pot. Yes, I'm one of them people. I eat out the pot. And then, there you go. The little crab legs. I got that's the snow crab and the Dungeness crab. That's all I need. Not too much. Nothing too crazy. I'm going to also make a salad, too. And I got this avocado that I had yesterday. So put that avocado together. Don't look in the ashy hands. I just washed them. Y'all hear sorry. But yeah. So that's it for the food. That's it. Alright y'all. I am finally ready to eat. I am so hungry. I ain't had no seafood. I had no crab legs. And maybe like it's been a while. Um, I think actually, well, my, actually, no, my sister was here. I got a picture. Me and her did a little date, and I did <laughs> seafood and um, uh, Asian noodles. So, what's up, to Blend? What's up, to Blend? Hey, your girl's back. Hey, your girl's back. Hey, your girl is back with another mukbang, and I'm just, you know. I had to do that twice in the vlog. I don't know. It's just, it just feels like another video. Like I wanted to go switch the vibe over and then I'll go back to vlogging it. You feel me? Um, I had a subject in a long time. So I think I'll have one. I just had one in the other videos y'all see me uh, do with the bagel. Which we're going to talk about that. But let me let me bless the food and then we're going to get into eating and everything. And I'll tell y'all what I have and everything. So hold on. Less. All right, amen. So, um, I got some sesame seed. That's what I keep looking at. I got these sesame seeds going. These noodles that's under the crab. This plate is supposed to be for the crab shell, but I'm thinking I'm about to move them out. And then I have some um, seed, some roasted seaweed, which I actually only have one left. So, 
I think it's a half because I think I ate half of that already. But yeah, I uh, also, okay, so sesame seeds, this, that's not even the main thing, sorry. I have a Dungeness crab, snow crab, some avocado, and some spicy um, cheddar noodles. Like, I, I threw the package out, so I can't show you, but I have had these on the channel before. It's so many move bones back when I was still living in Vegas, and it was a pink package, so yeah. Now, what I'm excited to tell y'all about is how I've been doing fresh everything with the, the drinking, and I'm, I'm proud of myself. Not everything, but I've been at home making it. So this is fresh brewed tea and lemonade. So what's the, is that Arnold Palmer? Arnold, Arnold Palmer is the drink, right? You a whole bartender and you trying to figure that out. We're not gonna worry about none of that right now. Um, but it's tea and lemonade. This is, uh, what kind of tea is this child, child? It's turmeric, peach, and ginger. And then I have some fresh lemons and I did the lemon squeeze, pulled up the honey, and boom, we got a picture of that. Let me, let me, let's, let's, let's do a little, we're going to do a little ASMR. ASMR. I'm excited. Okay. Let me see. How pretty. Look how pretty. Yes, and I filled it to the rim because look at how pretty that is. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, let's sit down. Yeah, yes. I had a little taste too. It's good. Uh, it's too, it's probably a little bit more lemony than I need it to be. Uh -huh. I'm going to have to um balance that back out with a little more. Probably a little more honey. So yeah, let's let's get to it. We must move these crab around because they in my way for my noodle. Okay, and my avocado and oh. Oh. Y'all hold up. It ain't I don't remember what I did. But what we about to do is this here. I don't know. It look a little whatever, but Let's do. Or I can do one of these. We can make it about the tea, you feel me? I'm not. We not. I don't feel like doing that. I'm about to eat. <laughs> I am tripping, y'all. Um and I forgot what I was talking about, but it's okay. I always forget. I always forget. I'm going to go get my head checked. I don't think it's good to forget things like that. I'm already spilling things. Get these sesame seeds popping. Look, these are so good. Ooh. Chew out the way. Get some of this going. I'm not trying to be proper or nothing. Like, this is vlog. It's, I'm really winging it. I've been winging it the last few videos, too. So, I really got to get together with this winging it energy. It's not not always a good thing but we here like I say I'm here I show up on this camera it might be every other week it might be every other month but I am still here <laughs> that will be me talking to me so we folding all these up so we can have these little cubes of seaweed for me to eat with my fizzed so we're gonna sit them over here with the crab leg we're going to get us a crab leg. And we about to get cracking. <laughs> oh, she corny. She is. She a little bit corny. It's cool, though. It's cool. I'm trying to see what this flavor came for. Because I didn't do nothing special. I didn't make no butter sauce. None of that. None of that's happening, okay? None of that's happening. So, let's see. Mm. It is good. It most definitely is. So let's go. So I said I had a topic. What am I at? How many? How much time has gone by? Y'all, we at the six minute mark. These, I did good. Good flavor. Good flavor, Missy. Um. 
So I guess we can talk about friendships. Like what is, what is a friendship anymore? Like this is what's starting to be sad. What is a friendship anymore? Like so y'all I've been hold on. Sorry. Oh. F no. Just FYI. Silas is awake. He is awake. So if he comes and interrupts the move on, just know that he's awake. So far I'm down set. I'm like, okay, Michelle, it's like 20 minutes, you're gonna be good. But you should be surprised how you can't get through 20 minutes with a two-year-old. You feel me? I know my mama's feel me. I know the mama's feel me. So, friendship. I don't. Okay, so we're gonna talk about me and my own personal definition of what friendship is for me to me. It's like family, a relationship that you have. I'm put some of this crab meat in here in this noodle that you have with somebody. Just like people understand, like people don't understand, like romantic relationships need to have friendship in them, and friendships need to just have relationship people need to understand that a friendship is a relationship everything in relation to another person is a relationship your friends your family your children the, your co-workers just people that you're meeting along the way if you're going to spend the time and take the time to get to know these people then that's going to turn to, to turn into and so, some type of sort of relationship so i mean how or what are we you have to be relating to the person for it to be a relationship in the first place. So, I've been going in and out of friendships this last 2021. And now a little bit of 2022. And I'm like, you know, sometimes I'll be going like, why do I care so much? I've had friends that ask me, why do I care too much? But I'm like, that's who I am. I feel like if I can, if me and you can have it out. Have a disagreement. I can go toe to toe and back and forth with you, and we can sit down like some grown people and reconcile and and talk it over and agree to disagree and see each other's point or whatever. If we could be grown about it, then that's cool. But what I'm not gonna have is somebody attacking my character, and that's what I have been experiencing. Mm. Experiencing. That is what has been happening to me. <laughs> that's what I've been experiencing the last few months and I'm just like am I maturing, maturing by myself or like are people acting like they're maturing and they're not like what is what is what is going on and a lot of times I always be like something great must be getting ready to happen because when I go through a whole bunch of stuff or start losing people something good happens so I'm gonna let the universe do its thing and I'm gonna listen that's what I'm gonna do but anyway, I, I, I got personal because I just went through something personal recently. So, um, but like I said, like, what is that anymore? At this point, my most of some of my closest friends are family. Or they've been friends with me so long that they're family now. And when I meet new people, they have family energy and vibes like they really, really love. And don't get it twisted. I got some good friends too don't get it twisted this is this is like a shuffle like i'm going in through and learning and meeting people and greeting people and losing people and gaining people everything so i'm sitting up here and i'm like so what defines friendship what does define friendship to you put that in the comments down there what defines friendship We're going to move you over here. Yeah. Like I said, for me, I got to be able to stick and move and ride or die and all that stuff together. And get into it and, and know that it's okay to be mad at your friends sometimes. It's okay to be mad at your friends. We be, be afraid for our friends to be mad at us. No, because our friends make us mad. 
So if everybody, we all human beings. Like, you know, even children, like, people think it's crazy to be friends with your child. It's like, no, heck no. Because if my child don't even feel like I am his friend, then he is not about to tell me nothing or share with me. Like, I'm not, my goal is not to push him away. It's to train him up as he should be and let him fly on his own. But nowhere in my head do I think that I'm trying to push him out to the streets to be here, little black boy, too. And I'm already like, mm-mm. So it's like, no, I need him to come in here and be like, Mama, I went through this and this and that today at school. And this and this and that with this girl or whatever. And I'm like, I don't really know about the school thing in the first place. But I know he's going to get to a point he's going to go to school. Because I'm teaching him at home. Y'all let me know if y'all want me to do videos or stuff. I was thinking about doing that, but... I've been going through these distractions and kind of been behind on things, important things I should be doing. But all of that is changing. Like, I'm not even, not even saying it's getting ready to change. It's legit changing. Like, I'm going through this right now. This started being about friends, but like I said, it's whatever. We winging it. But I'm not about to have my kid out there. I need him fearless. He already fearless. And I need him to be my friend. So that he know that he always got a friend in me. And just like I got a friend in my mother. My mother is one of my best of friends. Yes, as my mother, she just drives me a little crazy. But I'm sure I do as her child. But the relationship that me and my mom have is 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 it's something good, something special. And I love my mom. I'm getting so good, she. Anyway, um, what else? Let's see. I don't know. I think I'm going to do a more in depth video like this and I'm going to write stuff down because I'm just sitting here winging it. I am digging in these crabs. So. Go, go, yeah. Oh, real savage. And I can't even. Speaking of friends, I got new vegan friends that probably <laughs> would not appreciate me doing all that. You know, they know, they know, they know. I can see for myself, but I'm like, I want y'all to watch my videos. I don't know about these here. Like, I told them I probably do vegetarian, like a little, little of that here and there, but I don't know how far fully into it I'm willing to go. And it's crazy because I'm, I've seen, I can see myself not eating nothing. Once you get into it, it ain't hard no more. Once you figure it out, once your mind is really made up and you're really setting it, there's no hard. You know, my honey, y'all forgot my napkins. It do get hard on the streets, though. And y'all know I ain't been really eating much of nothing. I don't know if y'all came to see me eat, but I kind of felt like talking. I always feel like talking, but I actually had some things on my mind to really talk about. Um, so we did friendships. I mean, it wasn't that much more than I want to touch on, other than it's real simple. It's a relationship. Everybody should be having respect for each other. We should all be loving on each other. For real. Because we dropping like flies. And they trying to make it real easy, easy. And they real, real whack if you black. I don't know where that came from. I've been hanging with rappers and free people. have been freestyling, okay? But no, we, we know no secret in our, in our community, in our black world. So or to the world at this point. I even told my new friends I love them because it's just like love is universal. People, you say the word love or say you love somebody or you in love and they, people freak out. And act like, oh, you're going to be so, uh, so emotional. It's like, no, like, 
love is both good and bad. Like they say, jealousy is love and hate at the same time. Now she's for real. For real. Oh, the thing is following my face and I'm tripping. It, it really is. Jealousy is loving at the same time. Listen, just because I'm not tearing this food down, don't mean that it's not good. What I need to taste is this um, Dutchness, though. I didn't taste this one. Ooh, okay. We falling in. Go ahead. I'm in there then. I had some on my on my arm. Silas is really setting busy in here. I think this was a good, some good topic, you know, pretty cool. I eat a little bit for y'all. Be a little quiet. For those who came to see me, I don't know if I told y'all before, but. I'm still working on revamping this channel. I don't know how long it's gonna take me or when I'm get to it, but I'm working on a lot of things with my business, um, personal life, my kid, which is the part of the personal life. Um, what else? Health, gotta get all that stuff together, so. And then, you know, I'll come up and try to start vlogging some of those things. What is going on? Is it? Okay, y'all. So, it's the next day. My camera um, ran out of space yesterday. And then, I had to tend to sigh and everything else. So, that was the end of the mukbang. I'm sorry. Um, but I feel like that was a good, it was a good thing. It was a good mukbang with the subjects and stuff. I'll hit on that again. I think I'll make it a topic video. I said, I think, because I'll be telling y'all I'm going to do stuff and I don't get around to it. So I got to do better with that. But I have so many plans right now. Like, and it's like, my brain is going, Poof. so it's a whole lot. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling very productive. Getting some stuff done. Um, I just paid a artist for a Mixy Missy label. So <laughs> we that's going to be coming up. I'm getting to work on that. Getting to work on that like this. That's a big deal for Mixy Missy's laboratory. Because I have not ever had a label. And I have been going so crazy about having one. That it's taking me years. Plus it's been like life distractions and everything else. Y'all know how it goes. But like from last year to this year it's been just like this scratching my head about the label you know and who gonna do it and how's it gonna get done and you know for a good good label you gotta pay some good good money so i don't really and i just didn't have it and I, i'm just feeling blessed and i'm feeling like now is the time to really really like jump jump on it. it's always the time to jump on it but you know how you get this little there's something in you that you can't shake type of vibe that's what it was so and i came up on um uh a little bit more money than usual so i was like pause stop let's make sure we do the right thing with this because it's real easy to go and just buy me some shit that i'm like no we are investing so a lot of good good things the surprises um this year should be exciting this year will be exciting so y'all gonna have to follow me on all the social media platforms too because they I mean sometimes everything don't get, don't make it to YouTube, you know. So that's why you gotta have Instagram and your Snapchat and I'm getting ready to do TikTok. I have not been into TikTok and I don't know why, but I'm gonna have to get into TikTok. Um somebody so many said do a Twitter account, I'm like, I really don't care about Twitter no more but Twitter is still alive and in effect like people are really on Twitter heavy like I was like dang I ain't really okay but yeah I gotta redo my hair I got an event tonight um I don't know if I'm vlogging that so I'm not gonna make no promises <clears throat> there either will or will not be a vlog at the event because I'm bartending and when I'm bartending I don't want to be babysitting the camera I also don't want Somebody else responsible for the camera. That's their person that's like legit with me. I already know what person I would have do that for me. But 
they're unavailable so that's not going to happen um but what i will do is take it with me like and leave it like in the car you feel me and if i feel like i can have i have someone around me that'll do some footage for me that does good footage and that is um i can trust to keep my brand new baby then i'll do that so that's gonna be it for this uh video you guys so thank you guys so so much for watching make sure that you like comment share and subscribe because if you don't subscribe then what you watching me for <laughs> you feel me what you watching me for <laughs> subscribe y'all it don't cost you nothing to subscribe it'll give me paid if you watch it don't call you know they don't pay me nothing for you to subscribe either but they will pay you for my views and if that happens because I'm, I'm still at the thing where i'm not getting paid for youtube i kind of use youtube as a um well i like to see my life so i like watch it and stuff my friends watch it and stuff but it's also another platform for me to show my skills and talents so what has happened is i've gotten people hitting me up asking me to do videos for them or to edit videos and stuff for them so it's working for me because they'd be like well you edit i'm like some of your work i'm like well it's personal work but you can go on youtube and you can see but i make instagram reels too and people have been um hitting me up asking me for those so i'm getting ready to start charging and doing work on those too because i've only been doing my own i think i've done a few for a few people they pay me here or there but like a real depending is is a flat a certain flat rate and then depending on what you want it's gonna go up and that's the same thing with my videos but anyway that's not what this is about we on five minutes and i have to finish in look at this room a mess right no no it's not really a mess i got up i did some uh me and my aunt silas went to the park this morning and i jogged and did some walking and Silas played and my auntie did some walking so I did that and then I just this is this little change um and then when I came home it was time for Silas's class so I took him into his class and then we came home and I'm now I'm cleaning up and we're getting ready to go to LA and I got an event tonight at eight so yep thank you guys once again, I'm going to start all over. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Because if you don't subscribe, if you're not subscribed, what are you watching me for? Okay. <laughs> Y'all know what I say. Peace, love, blessings, and joy. Deuces. I had a, I had a little wine I did. it was like some leftover wine from last night so if i seemed like Ooh, i did but it was helping me clean up so bye